What's up guys, my name is Bruno Rodriguez and this is Flick in the Flash with today's review over Aliens. Now let me just start off by saying I was not planning to do a review tonight, I have a lot of homework, but first reason. For those of you that don't know, I'm a college student at Baylor as a business major. At this semester I decided to take a film class because, you know, I love films, I needed a fine arts credit, so I decided might as well watch movies, talk about them, and have a class that I would enjoy. So every Tuesday at 6pm, the whole class has to go and watch a movie. And tonight's movie was Aliens and I absolutely loved it, so I figured I needed to talk about it, like now. Second reason. It's Halloween. Halloween. Scary. Scary. Monsters. Monsters. Aliens. 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 Farfetched? Whatever. It's a reason. The third reason is simply I just needed a break from homework, so here I am. Now, something you should know. Growing up, I didn't really watch a lot of horror movies. More of an action movie guy or whatever. But this movie, oh my gosh. <laughs> First of all, it balances the line between action and horror perfectly. It's a sequel to Alien, and this time James Cameron directed it, and he gave his own spin that differentiated it from the first movie, which was a plain horror movie. And this movie just had so many positives. First off, the cast. More specifically, the main actress. Honestly, I'm just gonna mispronounce her name, but that's how you spell it, and that's a picture of her. And she's just the most badass protagonist ever. And it's exactly what the film needs, and she acts it perfectly. She even got an Oscar nomination, I'm not sure if she won, but like... If the Academy recognized a performance from like an action movie, like that's saying a lot. Another character that I loved was the little girl in the film. Her name was Newt, and I think her and Ripley's connection was one of the best aspects of the whole film. On the topic of characters, the whole Marine crew really played off each other really well. I really enjoyed seeing them on screen together. The actors had some great chemistry and it made for a really enjoyable watch. Now, this movie kept me in the edge of my seat literally the entire time. The pacing is perfect. There's not one moment where I was bored. My nails are literally non-existent right now. First of all, I bite my nails, I'm working on it, but this didn't help. The tension that is built from the score and the lack of score in some places is phenomenal. Mixed with these very strong performances from the actors just created excellent tension. Now, while I was watching the film near the end, I was like, I don't even know how they're gonna finish this. Like there was so much tension being built up. I just couldn't imagine how they're gonna come up to a conclusion that was both gratifying and like the tension was let off. And there were multiple points in which the movie wanted you to like let go of the tension, and then they just snap you right back into it. To a point where you're just like, oh my god, just let him rest for half a minute. I am so surprised at how much I just really love this film. Like I said, it's not usually the type of movie I like to go see, but I'm so glad I saw it. And I know if it hadn't been for that class, I might not have. So I'm definitely really grateful that I did. And I'll now make sure to check out the first Alien movie, which I've heard is just as good. Some people like it more, it's pretty divisive which one is better, but I'll make sure to check it out. But all of this really just combined to make an excellent movie. I'm gonna give Aliens a 4 out of 5 stars. Guys, I really recommend this film. Go check it out. Even if you don't think you're a big horror movie guy, go check it out. You might like it. It's definitely not for everyone. Like, I'm really glad I didn't watch this as a kid. It would have completely freaked me out. I wouldn't have been able to sleep for months. But it was definitely worth the watch now. <laughs> also, these characters, if they don't have the most serious case of PTSD, like, ever, then there is something seriously wrong with them. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider clicking that subscribe button. And let me know down in the comments which movie you prefer, Alien or Aliens. Well, that's all I have for you guys today. As always, drop a like and drop in next time. Five. We're on express elevator to hell. Going down. Two. One. Mark. <laughs>